hydroelectricity. The best type of energy. This is a hydroelectric dam. Water is stored in the reservoir. The gates are then open, which lets the water through into the penstock, which allows the water to flow to the turbine, turning the generator. Cool, but what the frig is an electric generator? Here we have two magnets. One is north and the other south. Together they create an electromagnetic field. The axle from the turbine comes up through the middle of this electromagnetic field. Connected to the axle we have copper coils. As the turbine spins, so do the coils, and they pass through the electromagnetic field, creating an alternating current. Alternating current switches between positive and negative of the equal voltage. And it's the type of electricity we use in houses. Oh yeah! First the power is generated at the dam. The dam sends the power out in three phases of a few thousand volts. The power substation then converts these thousand volts into between 155,000 and 765,000 volts. Next, the distribution grid converts that power to around 10,000 volts. Next, the distribution bus converts the power down to 7,200 volts for use on neighborhood lines. Next, the tap converts the three phases to either two or one to be used in houses. Here we are on site at the Grand Coulee Dam. I said, here we are on site at the Grand Coulee Dam. This is the largest electricity producing facility in the United States and the fifth largest hydroelectric facility in the world. Here with us today we have Sung Kim, an expert on the subject. Thank you, Casey. You see, hydroelectricity is a great energy source for many reasons. First of all, it is a renewable energy source. These rivers are fed by great glaciers and mountain springs which allow them to be in constant motion and be constantly repl replenished. Because of this, unlike because, because of this, unlike other sources of energy like coal, 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 oil, we don't have to worry about running out, of, running, running out, or about having unpredictable prices because of constant changes. Also, hydroelectricity is amazing because it creates no carbon dioxide. That's right, no pollution. Unlike with any other energy source, acting on water, hydroelectricity spins its turbine using only gravity acting on water rather than burning something in order to boil water in them. The water and the dam. La 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 la. Ouchie. How long do I have to cry? <laughs> the natural movements of fish can be disrupted by hydroelectric dams. However, fish ladders like this can be used to help the fish get around these barriers. When dams flood areas to create the reservoir, they can destroy the natural habitats of many different animals. However, with careful planning, new habitats can be made and animals can be evacuated from the flood zones. 80% of the electricity in Washington State comes from hydropower. The Grand Coulee Dam is in Washington. 32% of the hydroelectric power in the U.S. is created in Washington. OMG! This is horrible. Dude, where's my car?